Hey guys, what's going on? I uh, hope everyone's having a good week or uh, whatever. We're halfway through December and uh, I'm just going to continue with my... Well, I think I took a week off, but I've been doing it a little more recently. Um, my What You've Been Playing episodes. Um, I haven't done a, what, I've been, what I've bought lately just because I haven't bought anything. Uh, I've been really good. Um, but once Christmas comes, I'll have a lot to show you guys because I have a lot of games um, that I should be getting for Christmas. Um, but continuing on with my What You've Been Playing... I got like, so I've been playing like five games, um, so I'll get right into it. First one is digital copy, so I can't really show you, um, is Pixel Junk Shooter. Uh, if you, my review is up, I've been just been playing more of that game. Um, I wanted to, I played a lot yesterday, and I just wanted to get the, the review out, um, but it just keeps getting better and better and better. Um, the, the, the boss battle that I've gotten up to is, is awesome. Um, I probably should have, in hindsight, waited a little longer uh, to do the review, but I just wanted to get it out really fast. But my opinions of the game haven't changed. Um, it's still great. I still wish there was um, a little more of, of a lock-on system. But other than that, it's great. If you have ten dollars to spare, or you you game share with somebody or whatever, um, definitely pick it up because it's it's a blast. I, I'm not a big PSN or Xbox Live Arcade, you know, downloadable guy. Um, but this game I actually really love. Uh, definitely recommend it to anybody who. Uh, you know, who has a PlayStation 3, really, um, it's a, like, you know, just watch my review, I guess, it's probably easier, but the next game is a Dreamcast game I've been playing, House of the Dead 2, uh, me and some friends, I'll, I'll talk about it a little here, um, actually, you know what, I've just been playing House of the Dead, I'll tell you at the end of that, at the end of the video, um, but it's a blast, this game, uh, my, I have the light gun, um, but it doesn't work that well anymore, so I've just been playing it with, uh, with the controller, and it's great, uh, it's just so much fun, it's really hard, um, to play, just, not really hard to play, it's just difficult, because it's very easy to get, um, you know, to get game over, have to start at the beginning again, um, because it's, it is, this is just an arcade game ported to the, to the, uh, Dreamcast, but it's a lot of fun, uh, probably a lot of the, uh, What's it called? A lot of the light guns probably won't work that well anymore. I've been playing it on my old TV back there, and it still really didn't work that well, which kind of sucks, but what can you do? But still, play with the controller, it's still really good. Next game uh, is, I've been playing a little bit of Li Little Big Planet. Um, still love this game. Um, the replay value in this game is just amazing. Um, I can't even tell you how many hours I've put into this, just because every time you turn it on, there's new levels to play, you know, designed by other people. I still have to get the PSP, uh, the PSP one, but I should be getting that for Christmas, and yeah, awesome game, still chugging away a little bit at a time at Modern Warfare 2 last week, I beat it, and I put my review up on that, um, it, I don't know why it took me so long, I just stopped playing it for a little while, and went to the multiplayer and stuff, but awesome, awesome, you know, just multiplayer, I guess, I should say, and last but not least, I, I really started getting into this, and then I, I kind of put it down for a little while, but I have to get back to it, um, Final Fantasy XII. I really like this game. Uh, in the beginning, it reminded me a lot of Fable, that you just walked around the town, and you got little quests and stuff that you can do, but then I, you know, just focused on the main story, and uh, it got a lot more difficult, <coughs> but I really like it a lot. Uh, I heard it takes about 55 hours to beat, according to Retroclypse, or that's how long it took him. Um, me, personally, I'm about five hours in. So, um, but with school ending tomorrow, I have one final, then I'll be good to go for, for playing games. Um, so, those are that. Those are what I've been playing. Again, as always, leave your, leave your replies and videos and stuff like that. I always like to watch them. Um, but, um, we're hoping to, me and, me and two friends that I go to school with, uh, journalism majors and stuff like that, so we're, we're writers and we, we do the whole, you know, video stories and stuff like that. We're actually launching a website. Um, it's going to be called The Warp Zone. And we're just two or three, three of us, um, who just all play video games, want to do, uh, you know, stories and stuff like that, feature stories, reviews, um, news and stuff. We're going to have a weekly podcast. Um, well, hopefully it's going to be weekly. It should be weekly. Um, but we haven't decided um, how often we're going to do that. Uh, we're hoping to launch it at um, on January 1st of this year. Oh, well, 2010, I should, guess, should be coming up. Um but we're probably going to need more people to, to write and stuff like that. So if you have any writing background and stuff like that, if you want to um, shoot me a message, um, that'd be great. We're looking for people, especially who play the Wii a lot and would be able to review games um, for the Wii. Uh, but, yeah, like I said, uh, shoot me a message if you want. And uh, once we do launch, I'll, I'll let you guys know so you can check the site out. 
And uh, that's it. So uh, reply back um, to what we've been playing. I'll see you guys later.